What's howling, Lobos? 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 Welcome back to La Mesa Live. Today is Wednesday, November 14th. I'm Mikey, and this is my co-anchor, Ali. Please stand and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Attention 7th graders, if you are still interested in joining the La Mesa Live team and product a video production elective for second semester but missed yesterday's meeting, stop by room 472 and pick up an application form. Find out what's required to join one of the hardest working teams on campus. The Gay Straight Alliance Club will be having their first meeting in room 224 at lunch on Friday, November 16th. Come find out what they're all about. Good job to every robotics member this past weekend. Even though we didn't move on to the next round, we had a great time. It was truly amazing to see how our members worked together and embraced the core values. La Mesa is really proud of our logos. Way to go, everyone. Our next meeting is tomorrow, Thursday, from 3.20 to 4.30. See you all there. If you are in the Wednesday Circle of Friends group, we are, meeting, we are meeting today in the NPR. See you there. Please continue to donate empty recyclables to your Thirst Project team teachers. We will count points for your team every week. 10 points for a full bag and 5 points for a half a bag. Also, we are starting a toy drive from Defy and SCV. We want to bring some smiles to some kids at McGrath Elementary School for the holiday. Please bring an unwrapped toy to Mrs. Burleson or Mrs. Rojas's room. Thank you for your generous donations. The library will be closed before school tomorrow. Please plan to take care of your library business today or tomorrow during brunch and lunch. Safe School Ambassadors, you will have a lunch meeting in Mrs. Lieberman's room tomorrow. Your attendance is important. We will be discussing an upcoming field trip and handing out paperwork. See you in room 506 at lunch on Thursday. Hey Lobos, Ignite is having a meeting Friday at lunch in Mrs. Romero's room number 221. This is a club where we talk about different Bible stories while playing, while playing games, having fun, and making friends. Please feel free to come and bring your lunch. Don't worry if you have missed any previous meetings because anyone can join at any time. If you are interested, we'd love to see you there. There will be a cross-country meeting today at lunch. Please arrive at the gym, wait, please arrive the, to the gym at the beginning of lunch. Today in history. On November 14, 1889, Nellie Bly sailed from New York on her celebrated attempt to circle the globe in less than 80 days. She made it in just over 72 days. Today is also the birthday of Charles, the Prince of Wales. He is 70 years old. The word of the day for today is deduction. It is a noun. There are two definitions. The first definition is something that has been subtracted. The second definition is a conclusion reached by reasoning. A sample sentence would be, Sherlock Holmes reached his deductions through a process of eliminating all the possible wrong answers until all he had left was the right one. Something you should know about today. Today is National Pickle Day. It may be a dill, gherkin, cornichon, brined, kosher dill, Polish, Hungarian, lime, bread and butter, Swedish and Danish, or Kool-Aid pickle. Whichever is your choice, eat them all day long. The term pickle comes from the Dutch word pikal, meaning brine. 
In the United States, the word pickle typically refers to a pickled cucumber. Each year in the United States, 5,200,000 pounds of pickles are consumed. Pickles are a great snack, low in calories and a good source of vitamin K, though they can be high in sodium. Well, that's our show. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back here tomorrow. For Mikey and the entire crew of La Mesa Live, I'm Allie. Have a windy Wednesday.